Spa is, you know, without doubt, um, is one of the most iconic circuits in the world. Heading down towards Oroja, the Sandro Pierguini tucks it behind him and gets to the corner safely as this massive pack of cars descends at the bottom of the hill. For us, it's the pinnacle. It's the, it's the ultimate, our ultimate race. It's the one that we want to win. It's the ultimate challenge, 24 hours. It's, it's exciting. I did the spot 24 in 2013 and uh, the parade was very special. It's something you can't put a price on, you know, getting people involved, get them to touch the car and uh, I see all the kids all the time just, you know, bringing more and more and more and more smile to their faces. It's, uh, it's priceless. To, to get that close to the cars, to the race drivers, and I think this is something the fans want to see. Uh, well, yeah, Spa means a lot to me because I'm obviously from Belgium and uh, it's a very big race and I think you could say it's the, the biggest GT race in the world. We go racing! Lance Van in the Audi leads them away. How many series are there in the world where you have so many supercars on one grid and such a big grid? I remember going through a Rouge for the first time at Spa and I had a huge smile on my face. And that's the hitting hand at the best part of 120 mile an hour. Oh, dear me. Oh, hold your breath. So you get into Blanchiment 1, what am I going to do? Am I going to lift or not? No, I'm not lifting, I'm not lifting. And you plant down on the apex and go, yeah, awesome. You have uphills, you have downhills, you have quick sections. Another massive shunt. You need to push, but still keeping in mind that if you do a mistake, you're going to hit the wall pretty hard. Hurt little finger, maybe. It makes it really special. A perfect lap. Yeah, you can feel it straight away. Hard on the brakes, catching the traffic. And you try not to miss up the lap. You're like, oh, okay, it's gonna go, it's gonna go. In. Every lap throughout the 24 hour race is a challenge. The, the entertainment is always good as well. You know, there's lots of uh, fun stuff to do. There's always some good food as well, you know. A small advantage on the track. Things run normally, it will be very tight to the very end. For sure, it's going to be close like this. Still 14 minutes to go. Gets up alongside and gets them through. Rene Rass, Lance Vantor, and Marcus Finkelhoff will win the total 24 hours of Spa. Yeah, a race. I will probably never forget. And three delighted drivers celebrate at Spa. Lawrence Van Tour, Rene Rast, Marcus Finkelhoff win not just the Pro Cup, they win the total 24 hours of Spa.